During Wednesday's Lexington Mayoral Candidate Forum, both Mayor Gorton and her opponent, Councilmember Kloiber, answered questions on multiple topics, including housing. In 2014, the city established the Office of Affordable Housing, which has built nearly 3,000 units across the city, with plans for 1,000 more. Despite this, Lexington is losing several hundred affordable housing units each year per capita uh, because both candidates weighed in on how to fix this problem. Every year, we try to put two to three million dollars in the budget for that resource. And then this year, I recommended to the council and they accepted putting $10 million into the affordable housing fund with the ARPA funds, the American Rescue Funds. So with that money that's in there, we leverage other partners who give money to build these houses. The more houses that we have, the more or the less it costs for each individual house. This is something that's often left behind uh, when the community brings up this suggestion, they say, what can we do? Are you only going to build the highest end houses? And all I can say is, the city can incentivize us to build houses at any price point, be it infill or expansion, and we need to take those steps to do it, looking at the overall plan, not just one specific program. According to Zillow, the median rent price in Lexington for October 2022 is $1,499, up over $200 from this time last year.